Yo, long hairs. El Rubio here. As you can see, I'm preparing for a formal engagement. This one in particular is a wedding, but for you, it might be a formal business meeting, a nice dinner, or a swanky outdoor cocktail party. I don't know. The point is, you want to have a go-to hairstyle for those types of engagements. So I'm going to show you my particular favorite for this type of occasion. And since we've already clarified that we don't call it man bun, we're going to call this little number the side part lowball. First off, is I want to start with damp hair, and I find that it works best when uh, a day or two days after I've washed and conditioned my hair. It gives a couple of days for the oil to kind of get a little bit into your air. hair. It gives it a little bit better texture uh, than like the day after or immediately after washing your hair, but everyone's hair is different, so you may have different experience. like it to be a little bit damp here, and I'm going to start off just by combing everything straight back. Uh, important safety tip here, if you also happen to have a gash on your forehead from bachelor party weekend, mind the gash and don't rake it with the comb. Important safety tip there. So I'm going to get everything going just nice and straight back. Set this for a moment and I'm going to actually just pull it back here. Make sure it all came together nice, it's looking good. So now I'm going to get the part going. So I'm going to take my comb and I know that my part naturally falls on my left side. You may have a different side, whatever you prefer. But I'm gonna go right down the center. And I'm gonna pull the hair straight down on that side and back just slightly. And I'm gonna do it right there and then go the other way. And that's where the part comes in when you do it on the other side. And you can see it forming up there. I want to get it nice and straight all the way back. I don't have to go all the way back to the back of my skull because that's where the low ball is going to be, but I got to get it at least back to the crown. Okay, so I got it parted pretty nicely there. So now I'm going to do one more just to straighten out, and then I want to take it right over the back of my ear. Bam, right there. And I want to make sure everything is going back in that same direction. Right over the ear is perfect for that side. Do the same thing on the other side now. Right over the back of the ear. Make sure everything is nice and straight. Okay, now I am really nicely set up. <clears throat> now this is gonna be pretty much like a classic highball, except on the back and low. And I'm gonna turn around for you. So, I got everything held together with one hand. This hand is really going to hold everything and I'm going to use this hand to twist. So I'm going to grab it like so and I'm just going to start twisting it. And my right hand you can see is keeping everything secure while my left hand is twisting all the way as I get closer and closer to the end. And the more I twist it's going to start actually folding over on itself. And I'm going to wrap it around. See right there where it twists, and I'm going to keep twisting all the way to the end, and keep wrapping it around, and I want to get this ball nice and tight. Now if your hair is really long, and if you have a lot of experience, you can actually tuck it right under there, and you can actually get the whole thing to stay just being tucked under. I'm going to actually use a tie here because I need a little bit more length still, so I'm going to take my right hand and hold the ball left hand just like we've learned before and this is going to be a three turn ball I got to make sure I get the tip there so it all stays in place bam there's my low ball so I'm going to take another look now at the front and if it gets like a little bit, I'm just going to straighten it out here slightly. I'm not going to do it really hard at this point because I don't want to take the ball out, obviously. But just kind of neaten it up a little bit on both sides. Make sure it's nice and straight going back over my ears. And that 
is a side part low ball. It's neat, it's tight, and that baby is not coming out until I'm doing hair whips on the dance floor, which will be happening. So your next formal engagement, give it a try. Until then, don't forget, subscribe to The Long Hairs, check out some of our other tutorial videos, and keep letting it ride. See ya!